The seven day stay with our strict parents is about over. And today, our Aussie teenagers will begin their long trip home. I know I'm going to forget something. I'm really glad with the person I am now and so hopefully I can take that back home with me and sort of be more determined and can do things without whinging because I tend to whinge a lot. So I want to be a Coleman kid, but back in Sydney. <laughs> What I've learned from the kids and how they treat their parents here is that even the little things that I think I'll take home. Lately, I have been taking a lot of advantage of my parents, especially over the past year. That's something I really like to change. I think it was great to get the opportunity to have them see a different type of lifestyle, a different type of parenting. It may not have immediate results, but maybe down the road, they may feel that, yes, there are other ways of living. There are other ways of um, communicating with people that work. See you, Alfie. Oh, yeah, uh, this is a present from Ross Bushy. <laughs> There's only something small. Yeah. Oh! <laughs> and you have to wear them. Yeah. Wear them. Do I look fantastic? You yeah. too, actually. Yeah. We, we was just puff it up on top now to make it the full height. Okay. Now you're not five foot four anymore. You're six foot four. Top of the morning to you. Top of the morning to you. <laughs> That's your Irish Thank hat. You. It's symbolic. And you know what? <laughs> Whenever you, you're kind of cross and you're kind of angry with mom, put on your Irish hat and say, look at a lovely person I was when I was in Ireland. Thanks <laughs> to look, Emily. And we love you. Thank you. <laughs> See you, Emily. See ya. It's been such a pleasure having you. You're wonderful. Bye, Emily Emily has blossomed out of recognition from the young lady that, that walked in the front door just one short week ago. And for us as parents, it is very rewarding to see that, that we can have such an influence. She's, she's a super girl. Oh, I'll see you all soon. Come here, big fella. <laughs> <laughs> see, you. see you, Mary. You remember your, your mum for a week, will you? Yeah. Always look after the inside. It's just as important or more important than the outside. OK? Good man, Harry. Have a good life. Thank you. OK? It's been a pleasure. Thanks for everything. You're so welcome, Harry. Bye, Harry. I feel that Harry is quite young for his age, and I feel he has the potential to improve, and probably in the next 12 months he'll change a lot. I think it's, it was a privilege for us to get to know Harry. We're gonna miss you. Get the onions, get the onions. Okay, okay. Bye. 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 Emily and Harry will go back to their old lives. I don't want to go. Hopefully, with a new attitude. Bye. 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 Bye.